back of your health through a dashboard. They offer a, a, a pretty cool way of doing that. Continuity, you can start an email or something on your Mac, finish it on your uh, iOS device or vice versa. You can answer phone calls on your Mac and take phone calls right on your Mac. I mean, it's pretty, pretty unbelievable, but you can do it. Now, that's just a quick run through of what you get in iOS 8. Uh, some of the new features. Now, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to I'm going to play you parts of a video I did a few weeks back. Uh, I've gone in and edited out some of the things that didn't matter, but I'm going to try to compare iOS 8 to the jailbreak and and sort of share a tweak with each feature. Uh, there's eight, I think, listed in the video. So, you know, right then I told you there's nothing for iCloud you can get or nothing. Continuity, you can sort of use remote messages in a way. And uh, also on your contacts, you can use what's called quick contacts. And it will put the contacts listed in the spotlight rather than in the apps listed. So keep that in mind when you're watching the video. So let's go ahead and get into that. This feature, Quick Reply, allows you to reply directly from the notification or banner anywhere in iOS you can send a message or reply to a message, I should say. Uh, jailbreakers have been able to use it through a tweak called Aki, and it works right from the lock screen or anywhere else in iOS. It's a very cool tweak. Predictive Keyboard has been around for quite some time for jailbreak community. These are pretty much identical features that we see in iOS 8 for the suggestive keyboard feature, as they, as they refer to it. As users type, they're given three different word suggestions along the top of the keyboard based on the letters that's been input. This really helps to speed up the typing process. Recently, Apple's also added a feature called Always On Siri, and what this does is when your device is connected to a power outlet, Siri is always listening for you to give the command, which is OK Siri. OK, we have seen this through a tweet called OK Siri, and what you had to do was assign a activator gesture, and when you input that gesture on your device, Siri started listening for that command, which is OK Siri, which works much like Always On Siri. Uh, the next thing is fast access to favorite contacts. Apple has added these inside the app switcher. When you open your app switcher, along the top, above the little cards, you're going to see little contacts of your photos, if, or if you have a photo of that contact, I should say, will be above the little cards in the app switcher. And if you want to call that person or text them or FaceTime, you'll just tap that specific contact. You'll get a little slide out, and you'll choose SMS, text, or FaceTime from right there. And you'll be able to perform that all right from inside the app switcher without leaving, okay? The next thing you're going to be seeing is uh, sending and receiving messages from your Mac. Now, we've been able to do that to a certain degree as a jailbreak community using remote messages, the tweak, I should say. And now we're going to have it in iOS 8. It's going to be re they're refer referring to it as continuity. They're allowing you to continue different things from one device to another, like you're going to start a message or an email on your iOS device, and then you want to move over to your Mac to finish it or send it, or vice versa. You'll be able to do that without any problems in iOS 8. But like I said, we've had this feature similar through remote messages. The next thing Apple's adding more photo editing options in iOS 8, such as the iPad's panorama feature. The iPad's never had the ability to perform panorama, the panorama feature. If you have been jailbroken, you could have installed a jailbreak tweak called Fiverr that would have allowed you to do this already. You could install it on any unsupported device and have access to that already. Next, you could have on iOS 8 added what I, the, the feature I probably enjoy most is the emergency contact.